Uh, no, sometimes it, it, it really depends. If I'm, if I'm concerned more about the silhouette, then I will. Um, and other times when it's, it's more about, I'll, I'll, put, a, I'll put gray. It, I, I don't use, usually use complex backgrounds. I occasionally do that in order to, to um, set a certain mood. But for the most part, it's, it's either gray or, or white because this is um, something that the 3D artist has to be able to understand and parse. And do you see how that, ho that highlight got even hotter just by putting that, you know, that orange uh, chroma right next to it? And it, it also changed the quality of the skin. It feels really tight and almost amphibious and wet. So I really kind of like the, the reptilian meets an owl kind of thing that's happening here. And he's, he's almost looking draconian, as someone pointed out. Um, so what we're going to do in order to emphasize the eyes a little bit more is we're going to create a skin pattern. Let's do very little feathering. <laughs> 